My name is Munira Mbabazi. I'm a PhD student at the University of Nottingham. I'm doing, um, I'm doing work on food and nutrition policies in developing countries. I'm in particular interested in Uganda. And what I'm actually doing with, um, with the, from the Ugandan perspective is I'm looking at um, how food and nutrition policies impact um, development through programming for nutrition. Normally the, the numbers of malnourished children and mothers are, never seem to fall so, so much. They are just stagnant. And knowing that there actually, is actually work that is taking place in the country, so my interest was uh, what exactly is happening? Are we doing things the right way or things the wrong way? So my study is going to look at that, but from the programming perspective in respect to the policies. I have worked um, on sustainable diets and my interest when I was working on sustainable diets was um, edible insects uh, because uh, sustainable diets should actually be diets that are uh, eco-friendly and diets that can actually last f uh, in the future. So I looked at edible insects, something that is self-propagating, and uh, they were acceptable in the Ugandan diet. So I was, what I was actually looking at is um, what, how much of, uh, what is the nutritional value of these insects and how can they further be used and incorporated into the Ugandan mainstream diet. Uh, the common insects that are consumed back home, um, edible, we have uh, grasshoppers, Rospolia nitidula, and um, the um, white ants, which are macrotani species, quite a number of them, the var various species that are eaten of the, wh the white ants. And then um, in some populations, they actually use uh, the, um, the palm weevil worm. So you find them, uh, you find that they're actually acceptable in those communities. They consume them and they're actually rich in minerals and proteins. And since many of our problems have actually been protein energy deficiencies, uh, that was an entry point that I thought nutrition could bring in and we look at it as a holistic uh, part of the diet. I want to continue doing research because it's one of the things that, are, that really fascinates me. I like to keep learning. And um, the other is um, I could still work with government uh, through the Nutrition Secretariat and also I could still work with um, other organizations like NGOs and something like that in delivering nutrition programs.